Welcome back. Yes, if you're a little cheeky, you might talk back. And, of course, talk back is a type of radio show. Let's have a look at the scores on this Tuesday night. Letters and numbers. Crockett, 13. Sean, 32. Final letters come from you, Sean. Can I get a vowel, please? E. And another one? A. And one more? I. And a consonant? C. And another consonant? T. And another consonant? S. And a vowel, please? O. And a consonant? H. And a consonant, please. And final letter, M. Here's the clock. Letter selection on this Tuesday, Sean. How many? Uh, seven. Seven for you. That's good. Crockett? I only got six. Let's begin there, please. Cheats. Cheats. I'm sure that you didn't and that you're not. <laughs> Sean? Uh, matches. That uh, sounds good as well, David. Well, in fact, it uh, harkens back to pairs. Uh, pairs are matches and matches scores seven. Well done. And uh, I had chemist at first and thought that was the best, but chemist plus an A is miss teach, which is to educate wrongly for eight. Well found. Well found as well for Sean. Seven points. And the last numbers are here to be selected now by Crockett. I think we'll go the same again, please. Four, small and two large. Thanks, Crockett. Two large and four small. And our last numbers for tonight. Five, seven, two, four and the two large. Twenty-five and seventy-five. The target number is 782. Thank you, Lily. Away we go. numbers for tonight, Crockett. How did you go with those? I got 788. 788, so you're uh, well within the score zone, just six points away. Well done. Sean? I think I just got on the 782. On target, 782. Gosh, well done. What did you do? I did five times two. Five times two is ten. By the 75 for 750. By the 75 is 750. And then added the 25 and the 7. Is 782. Well done. You got the method and you got the target. Well done, Sean. Nice work. Uh, your approach, Lily? Exactly the same way. Exactly the same way. That was the perfect solution. Right on the target and ten big points for Sean. And that brings us to the conundrum. Our contestants will buzz in if they think they know the nine-letter word. So let's reveal tonight's conundrum. Your time starts now. That was quick, Sean. What do you think? Injustice. I think he's right, but let's check on the screen. And the conundrum solution tonight is indeed injustice. <laughs> so that means after the final round on the score now of 59 points, our winner tonight is Sean. But you know what, Crockett? I think you saw that, didn't you? Just, just Sean just got in beforehand. Well, I had, the, I had justice in the two, the I and the N left over. It was only a matter of. It was a matter of a matter of seconds. When, when but he was, was, well, it was all over. That's right. He was just those couple of seconds quicker. But look, well played tonight. Been a pleasure to have you on the show. And of course, that all important dictionary to take home.
Thank you. Sean, well done. That was uh, that was pretty quick on the conundrum, five seconds or so. Yeah. And uh, once again, great score, 59. Thank we'll you. We'll see you tomorrow night. Great. And harking back to the uh, the head of the show, David, you have stayed very well composed. Very composed, and I think it might be time to do a pair of crosswords, Richard. Oh, twice the relaxation. <laughs> See you tomorrow night. See you then. And uh, Lily, so have you, you know, kind of stayed relaxed through the show? Yeah, I really like your trick. I think I'm going to start using it. I feel like a boxer. Yeah, well, I, well, I don't know about that. You, you can't do it during a conversation. It kind no. of gives away that there's a bit of tension going on. <laughs> See you tomorrow night. See ya. And thank you to all of you for watching and playing along with us this evening. We will see you tomorrow night at six when we'll do it all again. Good night.